Hey folks, how you doing out there? You doing good? Yeah, well, if you're not, I can't help you. But anyways, boy, I'm so excited you're in for a real treat because it's time for another Mr. Reiner 009. You know it, you know it. Wait for it. Craft beer review, that's right craft beer review because you all know how much how much I just love craft beer oh I just love it so much especially all those cunts that drink it yeah because uh, that's pretty much what they are cunts but uh, before I get into all those cunts like uh, Joe D and that incredible physique he has from drinking all that estrogen laced freaking uh, craft beer. <sighs> I mean, the guy's got more chins than a Chinese phone book, people. But, anyways, let's, uh, I digress. Let's uh, just, let's get to the reviews, shall we? <sighs> Shout out to Raining on Your Parade because I think he'll like uh, some of these, uh, he'll appreciate these. Um, first off, I'm going to have to uh, probably get my old man glasses on because I am old. All right, we got an old bra, bra be back. We have an old brown dog, Life TV, from Smutty Nose. It's, uh, it says, and I can't even read it with glasses, come visit our brewery and Hayride or whatever, Hayseed restaurant and uh, our fucking Tooley Farm in Hampton, NH, and online, and all this bullshit, and whatever. It's too much to read. Took too long. The hell with you. But we're going to have it, uh, give it a pour here. We're going to give it a pour. We're going to have to uh, get, uh, get it opened up here. So it's not a twist off, but. Uh, uh, yeah, look at that. Fucking fuck. Beer cunts, your smoke. Well, let's give it a pour. Uh, it's not really a regular glass. This is just like a fucking jar because this is all this fucking shit deserves. But let's give it a pour, shall we? Well, it looks to me like I poured about uh, a two fucking hand fucking pour, about ten knuckles in a fucking, uh, I don't know, in a hand. So, uh, I don't know, is that, is that, that's pretty much how you craft beer, uh, fuckers like it, right? Pretty much, uh, with, uh, like this, right? Yeah. So, uh, <clears throat> let's, uh, let's juggle this here. Let's, uh, set this down right here and, uh, kind of look at it a little bit here. Uh, yeah. Come on, focus, focus. Yeah, it's, uh, let me give it a smell here. Yeah, it, uh, it smells like pure shit, people, and you know what we do with pure shit, don't you? That's right. That's really where it belongs now, doesn't it, folks? That's right. Yeah, that looks pretty good now, doesn't it? All right, all right. That's good. All right, uh, let's uh, set you guys back up here, and uh, let's give a, get into another one, shall we? Yeah, let's do that. All right, what we got here? Let's see what we got here, huh? Well, we got a uh, Milk Stout Nitro, and uh, let me read something here, because God is so exciting. Aren't you excited, people? Huh? Uh, super smooth with soft roasted and mocha notes. Wow, that's, that's fucking riveting. Uh, good to go from the can, like a pro in a glass. Huh? Like a pro, it says, in a glass. Well, fucking A. It's made by the Left Hand Brewing Company. All right, let's, uh, let's, let's go ahead and uh, give it a pour, shall we? Yeah, <laughs> let's do it. Ooh, doesn't that sound exciting, huh? I'm excited. Damn, I think I got half a chubby. Let's try it. Wow, wow. Well, look at that, huh? Look at you craft beer cunts out there drooling right now over this. Wow. 
And it's uh, 6% ABV on this. Uh, wow, how exciting. Look at that. Look at that, huh? God, here, let me set that down. Let me uh, grab you guys again here and uh, get a closer look. Hope I don't turn off the camera. That would almost suck. There, look at that, huh? Look at that. Yeah, look, look, it's, it's so good. I'm gonna have to, uh... there you go. There you go. Yeah, craft beer cunts out there looking at that and they're drooling and shit. They come over here and just lap that up, you craft beer cunts. All right. Is this exciting or what, huh? Huh? We're. And guess what? It ain't over yet, people. It ain't over yet. This damn thing would focus. It's got more on the way. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. This is a craft beer spectacular, huh? Next on the uh, on the list here is uh, a uh, Founders. I believe I reviewed this uh, one time before. Founders Porter. So we really don't need to read too much. It's 6.5 ABB, uh, AVB, and uh, 45 IBUs. Whatever the fuck that is. I don't know, huh? That's like what increases your estrogen level, huh? All that fucking hops. You fucking craft beer cunts. Let's give it a crack, shall we? Yeah, yeah. Let's do it. Yeah. yeah, wow, how fucking exciting is this, huh? I'm so fucking excited. Here. Give it a fucking pour, huh? Yeah, look at that pour, huh? That's a poor, perfect pour right there, people. Look at that, huh? Look at that shit. Huh? Oh, look at that, huh? Oh, it looks like somebody shit their pants. Let's, uh, where's a towel when you need one? All right, let's go ahead and pan in on this one. I don't know. Uh, is that? Would you craft beer cunts say that's a a twenty knuckle head? I don't know. Go ahead, craft beer cunts. Huh? Look at that, huh? I bet you, I bet you guys are just fucking all excited about this. Well, go ahead and put your fucking pie holes right here, huh? Get in there, huh? There's your six point five I ABV and. 45 fucking IB fucking views or whatever the fuck it is, huh? Look at that. Look like look at this shit on the rim. This fucking shit on the rim looks like somebody shit their pants in here. It's awful. How the fuck can anybody drink that shit? So far, uh, I'm going to grade uh, these uh, after I'm done. Uh, but I think the grid, the scale is going to be around, uh, it starts at the pure shit level. Uh, so uh, we'll see, if, you know, some might be you know, you know, a little more pure shit than others, but we'll see. This one um, pretty much smells like pure shit. So uh, I think we'll just go ahead and rate that one right now, pure shit. Yeah, I think that's good. All right, so, uh, all right, we got another one here. Uh, I guess this is a, a pricey one here. Uh, it's, uh, you craft beer cunts you probably know, it's America's finest, uh, first, all imperial brewing company. Good Night Moon Imperial Milk Porter, 11% ABV by volume, 1.16 ounces. Uh, God, I'm so excited. Uh, headquarters and uh, whatever. Uh, fuck it. Who cares where the headquarters are? Anyways, always store and <coughs> in store and a drink in, in, in a fresh place or whatever the fuck. Well, it doesn't get any fresher than in the shitter, people. So uh, let's go ahead and uh, give this a crack. 11% ABV. All right. Good night, moon. Yes, good night, moon. Let's give it a pour, shall we? Good night, moon, indeed. Good night, moon. Ah, look at that perfect fucking pour, huh? Look at that, huh? Look at that shit, huh? Huh? Is that does that look good or what, huh? Fuck you. All right. It's uh, all over my hands. My hands feels like I, like I shit all over them. That's what my hands smell like right now, like pure shit, people. Pure shit. Let's uh, let's get. Wow, is that? I mean, I mean, look at this, people. I mean, look, look at this shit. I mean, this is awful. I mean, this just looks. I mean, I mean, look at the fucking shit. I mean, it looks like somebody's asshole exploded in here. I mean, it's awful. Anyways, uh, yeah. So. I don't know, just, that, that's what craft beer looks like, people. I mean, I don't know. It looks like some kind of oil slick to me. Anyway, this is getting too long. 
I'm going to rate this stuff. Uh, let's uh, let's see what it looks like in the bowl. It's pretty much what it looks like uh, in the glass, uh, and it pretty much looks like pure shit. But uh, here, there you go. And you craft beer fucking cunts, huh? Yeah, go ahead and drink that. I know you want. There, huh? There you go, you fucking cunts. There. Yeah. Anyways, well, uh, here we go. I, I'm going to rate this pure shit from a scale of one through uh, pure shit. Uh, pure shit on the uh, founders, pure shit there too. And uh, the nitro stout, milk stout, I'm going to rate that pure shit. And uh, uh, the old brown dog also rates, comes in at uh, pure shit. So there you go, folks. Uh, this is all um, overpriced pure shit. If you want to spend your money on overpriced pure shit, be my guest. Uh, I think uh, what it deserves is this right here, people. This is what this shit deserves. Fuck you. Go ahead and drink that, dwarf. Huh? Go ahead and drink that, up, dwarf. Yeah, there you go. Fuck you and your craft beer. And fuck all you cunts that drink it. Yeah, you're all a bunch of cunts. So go fuck yourselves. Drink only malt liquor, and don't fucking drink this overpriced shit. Do what I just did with it, review it, and then dump it down where it belongs. I guess that's good enough. I'd be, uh, might be, uh, stay tuned for a, uh, for a malt liquor video. Because just the smell alone, I gotta cleanse my palate. I need some delicious malt liquor to get this smell out of my nose. This fucking, it smells worse than dog shit in here, people. Worse than dog shit. Anyway, thanks for uh, joining me again for another craft beer review. I hope you enjoyed it, people. Beware. It's overpriced shit. Pure shit. That's all you need to know. You don't need any other adjectives like it's fucking hoppy, malty, dark, and chocolatey. Fuck that shit. All you need to know is it's pure shit. And that's what it tastes like. Pure fucking shit.